this video we will have a closer look on how to edit cable trace in 2D view. Select cable tray that needs to be modified, press Ctrl Shift A to activate the entire network. Now let's select the other elements and hold down Ctrl Shift A. Now we have selected both the networks and we can see that we have 47 elements in our selection. To select the shortest distance between two elements, we can press Ctrl Shift and two clicks. If we want to select elements using arrow keys, we can use Ctrl Shift and the arrow keys. If we select with area, select only cable tray, otherwise dialog will not appear. You can see the difference in the example here. If we press edit raceway, it filters out everything except the raceways. As we can see, all properties in this dialog are possible to edit. Now let's change the pattern of the raceway. We can also change the type. If we select the entire network once more, it is now possible to change settings again and this will affect the entire network. If we want to change height and width we can do this manually and create our own definition of the tray. As you can see here we can now go for 500 instead of 600. Now let's try to stretch our network using the grip points. Let's do it once more. If we want to separate apart from the network, use the contacts menu, select object and click right mouse button and push separate. Now let's select our entire network and let's change the inner radius for our raceways. Let's now change the radius of X and T pieces. Let's now move an entire piece of uh, the network. Now let's select our other network of raceways and let's change the distance. And as you can see it takes effect immediately. Let us now try a useful tool where we make raceway go over or under. Let's select starting point and ending point. Now we can change the new elevation, we will also set the new angle for 45 degrees. We can also select our piece and change the elevation from 3500 to 3400.
now let us change elevation of several elements we right click and define elevation in this case we put in 4000 now let's select the entire network and define elevation once more but this time we use adjust elevation it is possible of stretching elements with a grip point You can also add by pushing on the plus. Now we can push connect. And now we have connected our network. Now let's make a gap to the raceway. Select the starting point and the ending point. Now we can define elevation to 2500. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us.